Siren from this boss. Siren's another guardian for us. Matter of fact, anytime this music comes on, draw anyway. Yeah, anytime this music comes on, <laughs> just know it's probably something you have to draw from this boss. I mean, you will get them later. You can, but it's so far along that you probably wouldn't exactly. Give a shit. Exactly. Plus, there's a lot, a lot of these guardian forces have different abilities, like the whole car capture's ability. I'm making fun of. Those are abilities you get from guardian forces. You want to make sure that those things get leveled up as you go because they become invaluable later on. I mean, so invaluable. When you when uh Plaza Codal goes up next, hold the select and you can do that now. Like the uh, the power up thing. Because I swear I remember doing it as early as this part of the game. And I just drew siren. Acquire siren. Hold select. Oh, I guess not. It, what is it? It's, I think it's called boost. Yeah, it's boost. boost. Once you have to, and you have to get that boost ability. That's that's another yeah. thing. See, you get that. Uh, you level up that boost ability. You can do that. Because I did that. That was the first thing I did, and then I started doing the cards and refining. And, and early on in this game, I mean, you're going to use a lot. You can do a lot of uh, using your guardian forces and stuff like that, just because they hit the hardest. But once you start getting weapons upgraded and stuff like that, all you have the guardian forces is for the junction ability and the different special forces. Because everything else you have is going to be extra. What level is your squad right now? I'm not exactly sure. I forgot to look, but I'll check next. I think time. it's like 10, 9, 10. Yeah. He's all That's okay, because I'm probably going to put the boss's stats up unless you want to scan him. Because uh, remember, it scales. So I want to put the stats up for, you know, just in case if anybody's who's rolling at the same level or lower. Yeah. Which, by the way, I'm doing the editing. Uh, I'll this, go ahead, I'll go ahead and scan him. Just, just good, to scan yeah. him. Okay, good. Then I don't... Then I mean, it's not going to really affect me. My guys are leveled up enough and their health is pretty good, so... This ability, if you haven't played it before, is very invaluable because it'll give you their weaknesses and different things like that. And it'll just let you know what's up. And it'll tell you some stupid shit about fucking yeah, monsters. Exactly. And make you do stupid shit and like that. And you can rotate it. <laughs> I do that shit with Disco the fucking... Inferno! I do that shit with a certain character in the game and I'm like, yeah. I right, don't with scan. <laughs> if I can remember how to get out of scan. There we go. <laughs> That'd be funny if you left him upside down and did the damage. I think it'd be cool if it, like, it just changed his model and he actually stayed like that throughout the entire fight. Like, what type of bootleg shit am I looking at right now? So yeah, this is pretty much how most boss fights are going to go in the beginning part of this game. If you're just going to sit there and... I think till the end of this wall, I stopped using them. Yeah, pretty much. Like, I used them for the brothers and that was it. Brothers, if you have... I forget what it is. I think it's like Float or something like yeah, that. Yeah, Float. They're, they're easy as shit. Yeah. Fuck, but that isn't what those two girls are yelling when you come out? When they when you're going in and they're coming out, float. Yeah, they pretty, much, they pretty much tell you what you need to do: float the boss. Because if not, you're gonna damage them. They're just gonna heal back. That's later on in the game. We shouldn't even talk about that. That's later. Later. Yeah. Later. Well, at the mission at hand. Yeah. We're going against orders? Question mark. Not really. Yeah, not really. I mean, we're doing what we. <laughs> I, I, I'm actually I'm actually curious. Okay. Besides the inevitable Cypher taking off, where did he go? What is he doing? Do we like practically walk past him? Probably like playing hopscotch or something like that right now. More like, look at that beard. <laughs> oh. He's got that sorry, That, that actually hurts. Beard. He got that Surprisingly hurt beard. a lot, but you know what? That's okay because you have a whole other health bar to go through. moon, though. I mean, they, they made this game, they didn't make it like where she's like, oh my god, I can't beat the first part. It's just, it's not impossible. I mean,. Here's my question. Why did they have the bosses scale? They did it because in this game. They they wanted them to scale, I personally believe, because they wanted they didn't want it to be like, oh I have to grind, you know what I mean? Because Final Fantasy VII was if you your stats weren't up to it, you were I think I believe you were boss. I don't remember. It didn't feel like I had to scale because there were certain boss battles where I would just fucking lose. I think, like, I I think they wanted to, I think what they wanted to do was make this more like mini player friendly. Because I mean like, if you play 7, like, and correct me if I'm wrong, but if you play 7, you know, yeah, you didn't have to grind all the way, but if you didn't have certain material right, or you didn't, you know, level up certain abilities or get certain things... I think that answered my question as to why it scales. The junction system is completely different. Yeah. And people, you know, with their grinding and draws and stuff like that, I mean, you can draw, like, every once in a while. But, I mean, that affects your stats. Yeah. And if you draw all the time, your stats are going to be so buff, but you'll be, like, level 5, you know? Exactly. And plus, like, let's say if you, you know... And, of course, the patented cell phone interrupting, interrupting video. I'm just going to put that down right there. 
She'll she'll yell at me later. It's okay. She'll be fine. I say that. Yeah, she'll be fine. Okay. But yeah, and plus, like, if you know the uh, the whole uh, drunk tuning thing, let's say you decide to grind to max level and stuff like that. Theoretically, with the junction system, you're gonna one-shot everything because of the percent bonuses. You know, strength plus 20%, you know, and stuff like that. It's gonna make it too easy, so that's why they did that. So, in terms of Final Fantasies, this wouldn't be the hardest one. For any, like, if you wanted to get into Final Fantasy, this wouldn't be the No, this would be one of the easier ones to get into. I mean, the only part you have to get back is, you know, lane text boxes and a lot of talk for a while. You yeah. know, and figuring out where to go because a lot of times it's kind of hard to remember where to go. You go to a day's house. What? Yeah, like when you when you get you know when you get your airship and you got to fly around and stuff like that, it gets pretty hard. I mean, but because it expands the world and they tell you really I don't know. Which, 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 which where you go. I would think it'd probably be nine. Uh, nine actually isn't that easy. Um, nine no, because I had a tough time going through nine. And I've, I've played Final Fantasy for as long as I can remember. I honestly, I'd say 13. Uh, given, actually not even 13, 13 2. If you're just talking about you just want to get into a Final Fantasy and understand how it works, uh -huh. 13 2 would be the easiest. Because I, that game was not yeah. at all. And it has dip, it even has a difficulty setting. Yeah, any game has a difficulty setting. Yeah, it's probably, probably that one. But I played it on normal because I laughed at, I didn't even know it was a difficulty setting until somebody brought it. But then again, like, I'm not really a good person to get advice from that because, you know, I've played Final Fantasy for a long time, so 9 just seemed like it was the easiest to me because, I don't know, it just I seemed would, pretty... I know one game you shouldn't get into. What? Final Fantasy 1. No. Don't Final fucking do it. Any of the older ones? Oh, God. Final Fantasy, actually, in the scale of the older ones, Final Fantasy 5 and Final Fantasy 4. Yeah. No, not Final Fantasy 4. I lied. Final Fantasy 5 and Final Fantasy 6. 6 will provide a bit of a challenge, but it, the story's actually yeah. really compelling and good. Final Fantasy V is just a troll of an RPG yeah. game. It, it, it's self-aware. <laughs> like, it's funny. <laughs> yeah. It knows it's an RPG. It, it's Skynet. Like, it just knows. Like, it's gonna take over. And my phone... But Final Fantasy IV, there's certain mechanics, such as going into a particular dungeon or cave, where if you wear any metal objects, your characters are instant, instantly paralyzed with that thing. Yeah, that's, 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 ult you can't that's ultimate troll status. And how's it guy not dead yet, man? Jeez. Longest boss battle ever. I know, right? Like, we're doing pretty good too. Like, trying to keep everybody up and doing what I need to do. I think I forgot to change it to what you call it. The act of the ATB. Yeah, I forgot to change the ATB. All right, that's okay. You make it a top. Yeah. Not me though. <laughs> I wish a motherfucker would. No, I normally, I normally change ATB just because it gives me time to like think and think. stuff like that. Because now it's like I gotta hurry up because you don't want him to get too many attacks because it'll put you way behind. And if you get behind in this, man, you're you're in bad shape. Now my yeah. characters help are kind of low. I probably should kill them. Nope. Just wait till you one of them gets to a limit break and just prioritize that. Mass triangle. I, yeah, I really want Squall's limit break because I love it. I really want Lionheart too because that's. Oh. Pro tip. As soon as your characters are in critical state, no matter like remember in Final Fantasy VII or any other Final Fantasy game, Final Fantasy that had limit breaks, uh, you can only use them once and then that was it. There's no limit break gauge here. It's based off of your health. And all you have to do is just mash triangle after you do it, and it'll keep coming. Exactly. As a matter of fact, that's I usually do that. I did that a lot in Disc 3 and where I'm at in Disc 4. Mm -hmm. Just because it's effects, it prioritizes. It makes it so easy, and I think that's why this is the easiest. And which is also awesome because if you change the ATB to non-active, where they have to wait for you to take your turn, you can mash triangle until you get it all day if you do it. You know what I mean? It kind of kind of cheese, but hey, it's good. It's, uh, yep. I mean, shit. Especially when I was watching uh, the long really plays. That's what they would do. They would just mash. They would just bleep, 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 and I'm just like, Jesus. Alright. Then the break time. Duel. Who's going in for us? Booyah! Wait, you cyborg? Here we go. This is my favorite one right here. Don't fuck it up. <laughs> oh, he's up in the. He's like, ugh. <laughs> he's like army of one. Perfect. Trigger, 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 perfect. He still like such a scrub if you mess it up. Did he? He's dead. He's dead. Okay, he's dead. He, didn't, he, didn't, <laughs> okay. he, didn't part. he was just sitting. He was like, like, did I just break the game? He's like, I'm just gonna sit here and wait a minute. 
All right, and that's the boss, and that is how you fucking. That's it. how you do it. Now I was, <laughs> I was very sloppy. It's been a while since I played this, so I apologize for the sloppiness. And, but a lot of these battles, they just take just forever. I mean, that's it's all these battles in these games are endurance based. I mean, because in actuality, the GFs is what makes it take forever. You can't skip their animations. You can't skip their animations. You can't skip their hurry up and. Oh, and those weapon monthlies magazines, you need those because those those tell you what you need for your different weapons upgrades and stuff like that, so always get those. Oh, I gotta play Metroid 2 sometime. Oh, because I'm just, a, I'm almost done with the Metroid series. After I do 2 and 3 of Prime, I have to do Other M and Super Metroid. All that's left is fucking Metroid 2, which that game gives me a fucking headache. <laughs> Just one set music track the entire game. Man, that's so boring. That's so monotonous and terrible. Yeah. Yes, uh, and then Samus in no color, black and white. Yeah. But actually, there's uh, certain emulators out there. Yeah, you should do the first Metroid. I like that one, but it's hard. Yes. <laughs> Remember how long it took me to finish that? Same song. <laughs> so good, though. <laughs> well, I thought that Samus guy was a girl. You know, actually, in the... In the game guy, uh -huh. they said Samus was a he. They trolled. Nintendo was trolling. Nintendo always trolling. Shigeru Miyamoto was like, yes. I don't know if you noticed, but if you ever look at Shigeru Miyamoto, he's always smiling. I've never seen him not smile. Did you ever see that press conference about the Wii U? Did he not smile? He was. He was smiling. He was. He was kind of. He was cheesing, but he was talking about. Oh yeah. He was talking about. Luigi's no, it wasn't him that was talking about Luigi's Mansion too. By the way, I want to get that shit. So, dude, I saw that, saw that Walmart, and I was like, dude, I gotta, gotta get it. I gotta get it. I shouldn't have got, I should have got it, but I didn't want to spend all. I didn't want to spend like thirty nine dollars right now. Like, what is it for? Like, I don't do it. It's for the 3ds. Oh, 3ds. Okay, yeah. Oh no, we're tired. Oh no. Watch out now. We're going to monster here. Oh yeah, burp. <laughs> burp. You guys just saw that. You heard it here first, guys. I just completely failed. I'm gonna heal up real quick because it took a nice little whoop in there. What time are we at? Uh, on what? what? On that. Um, I don't know. How do you tell what time it is? It says it right there. 37 minutes, I guess? Oh, 37 minutes, okay. Yeah, did, and also disregard that game time because that, that, that game time, no, we're not. Irrelevant. Yeah, completely, utterly irrelevant. Actually, no, that's the counter. That's counting down while you're paused. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. I just realized that. I was like 29. Shit, it was like an hour. Yeah, it's counting down. That means you could lose while you're paused. Oh, hey, that is the counter. Uh, Good thing it wasn't like... Dude. Dude. Okay. okay. So at the end of Metroid Prime 2, spoiler alert if anybody's fucking wa like wanting to watch it. Uh, at, once you beat King or Emperor Ing, right? That 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 escape theme comes on. Classic stuff. Oh, this dummy. Yeah. <laughs> now go and destroy yeah, that's him. That's why you need to fight. Ew, face down. Ass up. Ass up. <laughs> He's. He's <like> <laughs> I'm gonna run here and save. Just nope, don't do it, man. Actually, what I'm it. gonna do is I'm gonna get into a random battle. That's what I'm gonna do, cause yeah, cause you know, damn. I didn't. I, that was the bed. <laughs> it better have been it the bed. It was the bed. I wouldn't do that when she's here. I'm not that rude. <laughs> We're gonna run. We're gonna run. It's got me. I'm not rude like that. There's <laughs> a lady in here, okay? <laughs> Love. <laughs> Come here, babe. Come smell my steak. <laughs> <laughs> it is nasty. <laughs> it is fucking gross. But imagine how many people said that to their woman. Oh, I used to do that stuff all the time. Come here. See? <laughs> Come here, Love baby. the gas. Hey. That's why we're here. <laughs> That's why yeah, we're this, here, this man. spider, you can kill it and get a bunch of XP, but guess what? I don't do it. I'm not killing it today because I generally just don't get two flying fucks. I want that epic music going, not this bullshit And I don't right want now. this bullshit-ass, stupid music. Like, Alright, I'm going to do here. I'm going to cheat. Uh, which falls cool. Cause guess what? Clash. It's allergic to electric. I was like, you know, in old school games, <laughs> when that happened, uh, you were knocked out of the battle. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's what I, was <laughs> I was like, I was like, hell, yeah. you? But no. I mean, they give you 30 minutes, and it's it's very doable in 30 minutes to get this out of the way. 
Actually, it's a very good one. Ooh, he has protect. Oh, protect. Yeah, you definitely want protect. Protect is amazing. It's, uh, against, what is it, melee, right? Melee, because yeah. Shell, physical because Shell is magic. Yeah, Shell is magic. Protect is physical. And you'll notice throughout the history of Final Fantasy, they typically keep with the same different you know, spells and stuff like that when it comes to that. Except the fact that we had Volt in Final Fantasy VII, and now it's Thunder, Thundaga, Thundara. Yeah. Which is dumb, because Thunder's the sound it makes, not the actual... Thing. Exactly. <laughs> but we just kind of anal with it, so just ignore it. Just disregard that. <laughs> but it's so true. What is it? Bioshock Infinite Limited Edition Pulse Elite Edition headphones? What the fuck does that even? I don't. I don't need that. But I'm just letting you guys know I will be doing a Bioshock Infinite at some point once I get my PC up and running pretty good because that game is probably the most amazing thing I've ever seen. Plus, it was really hot. I don't know where this is. Like, I swear I'm gonna put on the screen like every Elizabeth character I know. <laughs> like, it's just gonna boop, 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 boop. Elizabeth. Oh, no, he's not about to, he about to do it, ain't he? Are you dead? He just did it. Did you just get Final Fantasy VII right he now? He did it. You just got Final Fantasy VII. I got FF7 so hard right there. That Scorpion. Hey, when the tail is up, don't attack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Shit, limit break! Shit, limit break. <laughs> you gotta use it though. Oh, oh no. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. That's pretty much what the fight is. You get it to a certain percentage, you'll fall down like that, and you run away. You know, you know what I've seen was possible? What? Uh, I think after you get past this running away part, uh -huh. or not after this one, like on the bridge, you can juke the shit out of him and get away. Mm -hmm. But it's but so... It's so anal about how you're supposed to do it like because if you move because you have to stop before when you know he's going to jump mm -hmm. in front of you then you got to turn around stop and then go right back because yeah. then he'll just follow yeah, you yeah you can give him the okie doke sometimes why they just stood there i don't understand forget about it let's go oh squall you don't care about anything look at that bootleg animation yeah like if, you don't, run, if you don't run fast enough he will catch you and it'll be another random battle oh. fuck like right there see but he was right behind you. That's bullshit. Yeah, he was behind me, and then he went back down for some reason. It's video, yeah, time video to do game that. logic. Don't understand it. Don't really care to understand it, but it happens. What if you just attack him instead of throwing the GF? Really? You're not going to let me finish my... You're not going to let me load up, dude? Yeah, right. Like... Smell God. Give him the thunder. <laughs> Shouldn't have any magic. God, well, you didn't give her a draw. I forgot I didn't give her a draw, yeah. See, I, <laughs> what I, what I have to do is, like, off screen, I have to do that stuff because I get really, like, meticulous and anal about it, and I don't want you guys to have to sit through that all the time, so. I'm just gonna keep attacking. Ray Bomb. Except Thunder, because Thunder works really good. And I'll use oh, yeah, can you even see his stats on this? Oh, you mean, like, scan? Yeah, does he have stats, or is he just. I don't know, but I'm gonna have to kill Zell at some point. Cause he's, he's getting roughed up. He is getting roughed up. Like a baby back bitch. Come on, come on, go down. Fuck. He won't. Take a minute. God, God damn. Damn. He fucked up Zell pretty bad. Yeah, good thing I got my junction out though. Like I said, it's best to just use Junction because early on you're gonna need that little extra bit of help. It'll help because, you know, you don't want to just die for no reason and have to start wherever you are over here. So it's funny, there's no such thing as over level. No, no over level. I thought about that and I was just like, I'm, I'm too over level? No. There's no such thing as under level either. They wanted to. I think with this one, they wanted to break away from that emphasis so much on being like a certain level and stuff. And then people bitched back in the day. You know, when people used to write things in magazines and people would read Yeah, people just fucking just, oh, I hate everything because I'm I hate under everything about this game. It's like, now, nah, shut up. You know, you was playing it for like 20,000 hours. You know, you was playing that card game like a bitch. Exactly. <laughs> you played the card game forever, like. We know you was getting all the rare cards, the holographic fucking Zell cards. It's just me, or it's like games back in the day, they were like actually like harder than games like now. Okay, you see my collection of games right yeah. now, right? On a scale of all of these games, I can tell you right now, the only new game that I find that's actually difficult that I own 
currently is... Alright, we're gonna... Uh... Shit. shit. <laughs> uh, Assassin's Creed 3, We're gonna get to this next maybe? screen, and then we're gonna go ahead and uh, heal up, because Zell's hurting pretty bad. And, you know what, I can afford to fight this guy, you know, another few times if I have to, but my guy's really need to heal up. <laughs> you just gotta do it fast, dude. 